thank you so much for being on the show today. Hi, thanks for having me. So let's do a brief introduction. So where do you go to school? I go to school at John F. Kennedy High School. So what motivated you to join the Observer? How did you find us? So my family knows that I really enjoy journalism and editing mm -hmm. and stuff like that. And so they found it in the paper mm -hmm. and just told me about it. They thought I'd be interested. Yeah. And the rest is history. <laughs> um, I applied. I didn't think I was going to get it, but I did. And I really enjoy working here. Yeah, so I also am very glad to have you, all of us are, uh, in the team and having you do the fantastic social media work that you do for us. So tell me a little bit about a little bit more about the work that you do with us. Um, so lately all I've been making is reels for the social media, um, for the podcast in specific, <laughs> specifically, but I hope to do like more in the future. Mm -hmm. as far as right because we also took a very big break so now we're just coming back and we need to provide the content for you to make stuff out of so i think i you i remember you telling me a little bit about a film class that you're taking right now that's very interesting at school oh yeah i'm taking video production right mm -hmm. now and i really enjoy i mean i really just enjoy editing and film in general yeah so i'm excited we have uh, multiple editors on the team now so um what do you kind of plan to do with the editor role? How do you plan to help the podcast out, you know, in getting our message out and marketing us? Um, well, I hope to help with the engagement with younger people. Mm -hmm. um, like people my age, I feel like don't pay attention to news. Right. To the news, especially like community news. Mm -hmm. So I hope that my reels like reach more people. And because it is a podcast and more people are listening to podcasts, Hopefully younger people will see this and want to watch too. Right. And, you know, one thing that I've noticed too is there are a lot of the national level uh, news organizations. They will have a, a lot of social media content being pushed out all the time. So people who are our age and use social media a lot, they definitely come through that. There's kind of no way to avoid it. Mm -hmm. But then papers like us kind of get left out because, you know, we're not doing that kind of work. So I think to have you and to have Brooke, who shout out to Brooke, our other social media person, uh, our OG, I guess, social media person, and she and you together are making a great team. And now we've added Emma to the mix. So yeah, I'm, I'm very excited with what uh, you, the team of you three do with our social media and where you take us. So what are your plans with the future? I know you're still in high school. Um, what do you hope to do with uh, college or anything else after you graduate? I'm hoping to, well, I'm graduating high school soon, and I hope to go to Fullerton Community College, just for my GE, yeah. yes, general education, yeah. and then I want to transfer to Chapman. Wow, University. Chapman University? Yes. That's a cool one. I think I almost applied there. I don't remember why I didn't end up doing it, but I think you're then joining the mix of all the Fulton College people here. Yes, well, most of my family lives in Fullerton, so it's like the only place I want to go. Yeah, righty. Well, thank you so much for joining the podcast and helping us out with the social media, and I really appreciate you being with her, for being here with us tonight. Thank, thank you. Thank you. All right, we're all done. That was up to five minutes. <laughs> that was yeah. so